Mike Tyson created the headlines here in the USA last year. Many felt that he should have been the US representative at the Los Angeles Olympics. Twice, not once, twice he got beaten in qualifiers by Henry Tillman. It was Tillman who went to Los Angeles. I watched him win that heavyweight gold medal. What people are really already starting to forget is that there was no great medal to win. The Cubans weren't there, the Russians weren't there. If Tyson had been there, trust me, he'd have won a gold as well. It's Tyson in white, Trent Singleton in the blue with a gold trim. We're in round one. Well, we didn't get much of a chance to see Tyson. What he had to offer in his first fight, and already in what seconds? Singleton touches down. He gets a mandatory eight under New York State Athletic Commission rules. And already, from what little we've seen of Mike Tyson and his pro career, down goes Singleton again, left up this time. This boy is tough. Doesn't throw many jabs. Comes in, works close, hooks to head and body. And he's just a perpetual motion machine so far. This isn't going to go too long. Trent Singleton in all sorts of trouble. We're already in round one. The referee humanely has seen enough. Tyson shrugs almost as if disappointed that the fight is over so quickly. Walks back to his corner. There's Kevin Rooney, the corner man. Tyson, so much pent-up energy. Still unspent. We're in Singleton's corner. No acting, he's hurt. Tyson, the gloves come off. So, Mike Tyson, the young, fledgling professional. Two fights, two wins, the debut on the 6th of March. We're still only the 10th of April. And you just wonder how much of a tight schedule Customado and Jimmy Jacobs, his two managers, are going to throw at him. Tyson doesn't hang around for the formalities. He's had his arm raised. He's already leaving the ring.